Hello team, here today we're gonna to talk about this Snatch Grip RDL. So if a normal RDL, you're holding the bar and you're holding it this way, the Snatch Grip is a really wide grip. It's just like the uh, Olympic weightlifting move, the Snatch, where you bring the bar all the way overhead in one single movement. Okay, so why would I do a Snatch Grip? Well, one major reason that I like to use it earlier on with people is it's self-limiting, right? If somebody comes in and they're pretty strong, but they can't find a way to work out without hurting their back, a snatch grip RDL is a really good way to limit some of the load that they can use, right? That's number one. With the, just with the wide grip and the double overhand grip, it's, you're only as strong as your grip is, and that's what's going to give first. That's number one. Number two, when I bring my hands out and I turn my hands in, I elongate my upper back. Oftentimes when somebody has a stiff back, especially during a deadlift, we need to find a way to position them so that they can round themselves a little bit more. And if I've tried to cue you just if you're, if you're here, right, if I tried to cue you, hey, round your back a little bit, hey, do you feel your heels more? Good, good, I like that. If I tried that and it doesn't work, then there's, there's nothing wrong with adding in an exercise that just helps you find it a little bit. So that's number two. And then number three, I mean, if you want jacked shoulders, it's not a bad grip to do, right? It's really trying to pull your arms down and you really have to resist that. In general, deadlifting is really good for that, so keep that in mind. Um, also, the last thing that I like to point out, I, I don't know if it really makes sense, it makes sense in my head, with the arms further out, it's gonna shut the lats off, and those lats are trying to tighten your back up, right? So I have to be really on point with what my legs and my hips are doing, right? If I lose this position, I can't just rely on my lats to stabilize me now because they're so long and disadvantaged. They can help a little bit, but not a lot of bit, okay? So I need to find a way to you know, I need to find that position that we talked about already, right? I need to find this right here. And this is a nice, good position. I feel my legs right away. Perfect. I don't even want to move. It feels so good, right? And I need to be able to hang on to that, get a nice stretch in my hamstrings as I come down and as I do this exercise. So that's the Snatch Grip RDL. It's a wide grip. It's just a normal RDL, just like this. Make sure you don't arch too much. Make sure you don't look at the ground or collapse. Make sure you don't arch too much. Um, make sure you're not falling forward on your toes. Make sure you do have a slight knee bend, not totally straight. Make sure you don't have too much of a knee bend because it's not a squat. It's a hip dominant movement. And give that a shot. 